Hey guys, it's Melanie. So today I am doing a share the love. Um, I always mean to do these types of videos a little bit more frequently than I actually do, but when new things come out or when something new pops into my head, I'm always like, oh, I should do that first. And for some reason, this is the video that always gets pushed back, but um, I wanted to go ahead and do this today because in another recent video that I actually recorded on the same day that I'm recording this, I kind of mentioned um, that I was going to be doing a share the love and that I was going to try to get that out soon, so I'm going to make this a priority. Okay, so I have three channels for you guys today, which I am going to link down below in the description box. These are three totally different channels. Only one of them is a makeup related channel and then the other two are just channels that I've kind of been obsessed with over the last couple of months and have just found a lot of like um, just good information on and things to think about and they've sort of helped me view some things a little bit differently and um, yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and get started because this is a beauty channel, I will go ahead and start with my beauty recommendation for you guys. And the channel I'm gonna recommend is LS. That's the name of her channel. Um, Elle is a beauty vlogger who is um, very much interested in panning. So the Project Panning community, she is kind of a big part of that. Um, she also does a lot of just really great chit chatty type vlogs on her channel and I would have to say that those are probably one of my favorite videos of hers to watch. She just has a very like straightforward and honest view of the beauty community and um, you know things that are happening within and how she handles the pressures of being a beauty vlogger and you know how she views like you know this whole place from her standpoint her unique you know channel so I've just really enjoyed watching her videos and you know she definitely has a lot of really great ideas and there's definitely a few videos that I'm going to be doing in the future that were inspired by her channel I will of course let you know let you guys know what those videos are but um, I just kind of randomly came across her when I think one of you guys actually mentioned um, her on one of my videos and I was like, who is this? I have no idea who she is. <laughs> and um, so I checked out her channel and immediately felt a connection with her. I really like her funky style. It's very different from my style. She loves a lot of bright colors. Her makeup is always just really beautiful and fun and bright. She plays around with her hair a lot. She's got different hair colors, different hairstyles. She's just very funky and she's so different from me in some ways, but I think I said this before, I am drawn to people who are just so different from me in certain ways. And I, I don't know why that is, but I feel like I just, I take more away from the either interaction or relationship with people who are different from me than I sometimes do from people who are exactly like me because you know I already kind of know what they're all about and the things that they think and what they love and what they dislike and you know I love that as well but I also love hearing you know different opinions and seeing different styles and you know that kind of stuff so anyway if you're not subscribed to LS I would definitely recommend checking her out I will put her channel link down below go show her some love and um, hopefully you will enjoy her content as much as I do I'm embarrassed to say that uh, as much as I love the comments from you guys when I watch YouTube videos I never comment usually because it's I'm watching while I'm folding laundry or doing the dishes or mopping the floors or you know like writing out an invoice for a client so I don't think I've ever actually I think I may have commented on one of her videos um she has no idea who I am but um anyway she's fantastic if you guys aren't subscribed you should definitely go check her out all right the next channel is um a channel called free to frugal and um, the creator of this channel her name is Kim 
I randomly came across her videos when I saw a suggested video on the sidebar that was a one month Costco grocery haul and I was like, oh I love Costco. <laughs> Let me see what this chick is buying from Costco. So I watched that video and immediately was like, I don't know what it is about her, whether it's the sound of her voice or just the way that she presented herself in that video, but it just sort of drew me to check out other videos of hers. And as you might be able to tell by the name of the channel, she is someone who is, she tries to be very frugal. Um, she has a lot of videos about how she paid down a significant amount of debt. Um, she has a husband and two kids and, you know, they, um, they have purchased several homes and have made, you know, a good amount of money when fixing those homes up and selling them and then use that money to buy other homes and they have paid off mortgages before, which to me sounds crazy. We just got a brand new mortgage ourselves here and um, the thought of paying off that amount just blows my mind. Um, but, you know, I she's, she, she's currently not living in a house that is the size of what we're going to move into, but... Anyway, I just, I just find her channel fascinating, um, especially her Costco grocery hauls. She does these monthly grocery hauls. This just amazes me that people actually plan their meals out and then go shopping for those ingredients. That's probably the dumbest thing that you might think has ever come out of my mouth, but that's such a foreign idea to me. When I go grocery shopping, I'm like, okay, it's Tuesday. We don't really have anything for dinner. I should go to Trader Joe's and find something. Like, that is how I grocery shop. It is the most inefficient, worst possible way to live your life when it comes to feeding your family because, you know, like Stella will ask me all the time, hey, what's for dinner? And I'm like, yeah, dude, I got no idea. Like, we need, we'll figure it out when we get there. <laughs> food is just not something that I plan for, but I love watching people who plan for food because I want to be that way and I watch for inspiration, and there are weeks where I'm like, oh yeah, I sh I'm out of milk, I should write that down. And then inevitably I forget to take that list. So I, I still have things I need to work on, but I love the inspiration. And I love the fact that she meal plans and then buys according to her meal plan and she doesn't buy things she doesn't need. Um, you know, when she does her Costco hauls, she's buying things in bulk that she's actually going to use completely. Um, you know, like we, we buy a ton of stuff at Costco. I love Costco. That's like one of my favorite stores in like the entire world. Like if I could only shop at one store going forward, well, it would be a hard pick between Trader Joe's and Costco, but I'm going to say that Costco would probably win out. But yeah, I just, her channel's just fascinating, you guys. If you are ever interested in learning more about living a more frugal lifestyle, advice and tips and tricks on how to do that, um, how to pay down debt, how to just sort of change your mindset about certain things, go check out Kim's channel. It's, it's fascinating and she puts out a lot of really great content. Um, again, she's another person who I watch almost all the time. Never commented on any of her videos, but... She's fantastic. Love, love watching her videos. Okay, and the last one is probably going to be the most, like, really <laughs> response, and that is My Self-Reliance. That's the name of the channel. The creator is um, Sean James. This is just this dude that lives in Canada, I believe somewhere in Ontario, and um, he is, like, building his own cabin and he he owns this huge piece of property and he's planning on um adding like other buildings on this property and he just builds this stuff by himself and it's fascinating to me and his like cinematography is beautiful like he has drone shots and you know he shows like multiple angles of him like doing things in his cabin like he made he made a sink out of a piece of like copper like he took this piece of copper and he like whittled it into a freaking sink like a working sink and I was like I would never think to do that like I even if I was building a cabin I'd be like great let's go to Home Depot and pick up a sink from Kohler like 
that's my mindset, right? So I just find it fascinating that he does all this stuff by himself. Um, he also has a dog, a, I believe it's uh, a golden retriever maybe. Her name's Callie and she's just the cutest dog, oh my gosh. And he just loves his dog and um, he actually, he has a wife as well and she comes to the cabin sometimes but she's not really in like the videos very much but I think she helps him out sometimes with some of the different shots and stuff. But um, he's shown a couple of videos of the two of them, like, you know, from a distance, like, interact. And I just, I just thought it was so sweet. Like, he just seems like such a genuine, nice guy. And he works so hard to, like, build this cabin and to create this place where he can go to sort of live off the grid and be away from the hustle and bustle of everyday life and just enjoy nature. Um... That alone is fascinating to me because this might be obvious, but I am not a nature person. I love the outside. I live in Oregon. This is a beautiful place to live. I've gone hiking and stuff, but it's not really like my thing. Um, I wish it was, but I love like hearing other people talk about their passion for the outdoors and conserving, you know, our natural resources and, um, how did, he's just such a neat guy, you guys. If if you are just looking for some random channel to go watch where you just feel at peace and relaxed when you're watching it, like if you have a lot of stress in your life, go watch that channel. There's just something about the footage that he shows that just calms my nerves and makes me feel peaceful and happy. And I just admire his like self-reliance clever name for his channel because he really does just work so hard to do things like on his own you know he doesn't expect other people like contractors like what I would expect to come in and like do these things for like he's doing all of this by himself and he does he's just incredible craftsmanship obviously I'm fascinated um he his videos are longer and um they're, they do take some time to watch, but I'll just watch them sometimes when I'm like laying in bed at night and we don't have a Chicago PD or Chicago Fire or a Dateline about murder to watch. So I'll just lay in bed and watch his videos and they just kind of are like so soothing and relaxing. But anyway, I feel like I spent a lot of time on Sean James. His channel will be linked down below as well. Go show him some love. Um, these are just three really great channels that I think you should subscribe to if you haven't already, if you have an interest. Obviously, not everyone is a weirdo like me, but um, just to try something new, maybe check some of these channels out and see if you are drawn to them as well. So Thank you so much for taking the time to watch. Um, I gotta go do a little bit more packing and um, I think put my hair back in a ponytail because I don't know what is happening here today, but we'll figure it out. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Take care.